Hello everyone, my name is Tejas and welcome back to my channel Search Terry with Tejas. And if you are passionate about computer science and aiming to excel in the ICSO exam, then you are in the right place. So today we are going to learn ICSO Chapter 8, Networking and Cyber Safety. So let's start. So Chapter number 8, Networking and Cyber Safety. Now first question, the Dash is a collection of networks in which millions of computers are linked together globally. A. Internet. B. Airpanet, C. Intranet or D. Extranet. So, Internet is a collection of networks in which millions of computers are linked together globally. So, a correct answer here will be option number A. Now, second question. Select the incorrect statement about Wi-Fi. A. It allows you to connect multiple devices over one network. So, yes, this is correct. Now, option number B. It can connect from very far away from modern. So, yes, this is also correct. Now see, it cannot connect mobile computing devices. So no, this is incorrect because it can connect mobile computing devices. So our correct answer here will be option number C. Now third question, when, when your organization is using electronic platforms and networks like intranets and internet to conduct business, it's conducting dash. So A, e-shopping, e B, e-business, C, e-production or D e network so when your organization is using electronic platforms and networks like intranets and internet to conduct business it is called e business so a correct answer here will be option number B so fourth question when talking about a networking and internet what is a port a an uh, external output device so no this is incorrect now b it is a type of internet software so no this is also incorrect now option number c it is a protocol that email messages have to follow to travel over the internet so no this is also incorrect now option number d it's a data connection that allows information transfer to and from a specific server process so our correct answer here will be option number d so fifth question, this word art is commonly seen during verification to determine whether the user is human or not. This is known as dash. So A crypt, B auto text, C code or D captcha. So this word art is called captcha. So a correct answer here will be option number D. Now sixth question, select the odd one out with the respect to web browser. So A, this is our web browser, Microsoft. Now option number B, Chrome, C, Firefox or D, Gmail. So our correct answer here will be Gmail. Now, seventh question. Match the internet services given in column 1 with their logos given in column 2. So ISP, so the logo of ISP is this. So A will go to 2. Now second one is search engine. So this is Bing which is a search engine which means B will go to 1 and now see web browser. So this is Microsoft web browser. So this will go to 3. So our correct answer here will be option number A. So eighth question which of the following statements holds true regarding spam? Statement 1 it is the it is the use of electronic message messaging system to send out unwanted messages in bulk. So yes, this is correct. Now statement 2, most spam are commercial advertising. So yes, this is also correct, which means our correct answer here will be option number C, both statement 1 and statement 2. Now ninth question, identify the following. It is a free mobile browser developed by the Chinese mobile and internet company. Now second, it is available on number of platforms including Android, iOS and Windows, I, uh, Windows Phone. So it is the UC browser which means our correct answer here will be option number C. Now 10 question, the given image is of dash, that is a dash. So this is a Opera Mini and it is a mobile browser. So our correct answer here will be option number A. Now 11th question. Some web applications maintains the list of websites and a brief summary of, of their content in large databases. These large databases are called dash and these web applications are called dash. So these large databases are called indexes 
and these web applications are called as search engines so our correct answer here will be option number b so 12th question web addresses can be written as words or as numbers so what are these numbers called so this is a ipa address which means internet protocol address so our correct answer here will be option number b so 13th question if you receive an email with an attachment from a company saying you just have won a million dollars but you have never heard of the person who has sent that email what should you do so in this condition we have to just straight away delete the email so our correct answer here will be option number c now 14th question several internet programs Uh, systematically browse the internet they mainly and periodically do such systematic browsing for web indexing this process of indexing is also known as so this is called as crawling so our correct answer here will be option number b now 15th question dash is a web browser developed by apple.inc so a this is firefox B this is Safari which is Apple's browser so our correct answer here will be option number B so 16th question a snapshot of google chrome is given here what is the in circle bar mark as p shown here is called so this uh, this is called the address bar so our correct answer here will be option number C now 17th question in the web address what does slash my school slash indicate so This is the folder where class we had dot jpg will be found. So our correct answer here will be option number C. Now eighteenth question. Identify the following. It is a piece of software. It allows additional function to be performed along with default function. It usually cannot run independently. It sometimes modifies the interface. It can also modify the behavior of web browser. So it is a plugin. So our correct answer here will be option number B. Now nineteenth question, which of the following is not a social networking site? So A, this is Twitter. Now B, this is Google Hangouts, which is also a social networking site. And now C, this is DuckDuckGo, which is a private networking site. So our correct answer here will be option number C. Now twentieth question. Which of the following statements is incorrect about an email address? So A, the first part of an email address is the username. So no, uh, so yes, this is correct. B, add symbols fit in between the username and the domain name. So yes, this is also correct. Now C, the last part of an email address is the domain name. So yes, this is also correct. Now D, the first part of an email address cannot contain uppercase letters. So no, this is incorrect. So the correct answer here will be option number D. So achieve section question number twenty one. Identify the following. It is a discussion or informational website published by or published on www. It consists of articles that are posted on a regular basis. These articles are usually displayed in reverse chronological latest first order. So it is a blog. So our correct answer here will be option number B. Now twenty second question. What happens when you click on the button marked as P after typing internet in the search box of Google as shown in the given image? So the user will be taken directly to the first search result related to internet by passing the search engine results page. So our correct answer here will be option number A. Now twenty third question. An organization. Have established a network, uh, securely shares company information and computing resources among their employees within its premises only. Uh, it is not connected to the outside world. Which kind of computer network is being used at this organization? So it is intranet. So our correct answer here will be option number A. Now twenty fourth question. Identify the following internet service. It is an American electronic com uh, commerce and cloud computing company founded by Jeff Bezos. It is an online shopping site that sells the variety of products. So it is Amazon. So our correct answer here will be option number B. 
Now, 25th question. Which of the following steps is correct? If you want to see all the images you have downloaded from the internet from Google Chrome. So, first we have to go to customize and then control Chrome, control Google Chrome, then present at, present at the extreme right side of the window and then download. So, correct answer here will be option number A. So, if you like our video, please like, share and subscribe to our channel. Thank you.